All right. This is a Norcold refrigerator freezer out of my uh, 2007 Keystone Hornet. And I've done everything to fix this thing. The board, the thermistor, the burner, the electrical heating element. The propane goes on fine. It's, it just doesn't get cold no matter what I do. This is the heating coil element. You can take that off, send it in. They want 600 bucks and you get a $100 refund for the, the core. Uh, I didn't do that. I just bought a miniature refrigerator from Best Buy and stuck it in the wall behind the camera. You can't see that, it's pointless. But um, I was getting ready to uh, just gut the interior, leave the doors on, and stick a gun safe in there. There's a gun safe. I bought it. It's on the floor. <laughs> it's getting all ready to do that. Put that gun safe in there. And somebody told me about what I can do to get it to work right. And I, I, I couldn't find any videos on internet, on YouTube, about what to do but I'm going to show you what he told me to do and uh, I'm going to try it and you'll see what I'm doing this seems silly but uh, I did verify it other people have done this they call it something else they call it burping now who would know to look up burping your refrigerator who the hell would do Nobody would find that video. So this video is just an RV refrigerator hack. I'm hacking it. I'm gonna pick this up, put it on the floor. Ah! There we go, it's on the floor. And, uh, and what I'm gonna do, check check to make sure there's no ammonia leaks. I don't see any leaks in that system because it's it's made in Switzerland, or Sweden, whatever, and it's filled with ammonia, water, and something else, and it's really toxic. So if you see any yellow stains or you smell that, just get it and throw it out. Get it out because it's very, it's uh, industrial strength. So, uh, yep, but I'm going <laughs> to, you got to admit, these southerners do have a funny way of saying things. Burping, burping. No, I call it tipping it upside down. That's all it is. Tip it upside down. And get everything from the tank to go back up again because my trailer's been sitting here for two, three years at a time, not moving and uh, not shaking and not going anywhere. And that's not good. So it's upside down. I'm gonna leave it like that for 24 hours and put it back in. And I hope it works. I'll make another video tomorrow. And if it works, maybe it'll work for you. If it works for me, maybe it'll work for you. So, I can hear the fluid. I hear it. I hear it. It was all in this tank. See this tank? There's the cooling unit. This is a holding tank. And it's now going through these coils and up to the top. And it'll let it sit overnight. And uh, then tip it back up put it all back in, plug it in, see if it works. If it doesn't work, I'm just gonna cut all this shit out, use the doors, put the gun safe in there. Call it a day. All right, it's Wild Bill, I'm out. I hope this helps you. See ya. I'm gonna title it, I'm not gonna title it burping, I guarantee you, because no one will find burping.
who the hell would ever think of burping your refrigerator? I'll call it something else. Hope you can find it.